Rolle, Rolle. Oh. Hey, let's get nervous. Yes! Yes! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Can't stop looking at it. Yes! Just, ooh! Oh my goodness. My lips are so chapped. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for coming to watch another video. I have been doing a seven day video binge for you guys. So I'm uploading a video for seven days straight. That's it. And then it's going to go back to the regular scheduled program where I do two videos a week, you know. <laughs> but I wanted to get these videos out because I'm going to be really busy coming up. And I wanted to challenge myself to just do a video every day, edit every day, upload every day for seven days. And guess what? You guys made it to day three with me. And I am so happy and excited that I have been able to challenge myself and have you guys do the challenge along with me. I hope you've been keeping up because if not you're gonna be like six videos behind if you know what I'm saying <laughs> this video today is gonna be a chit chat get ready with me I'm just gonna be you know doing my makeup and letting you guys know how I've been feeling lately what's been going on and let you, you know catch the tea baby because I got some tea to share with you today okay so first of all let me see it is my sixth anniversary, six month anniversary in Los Angeles. Like, what? 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 You guys, I have been in LA for six months already. Like, oh my God, I want to cry because the time has just went by so fast. So much has happened over the last six months and it's crazy. Like, I moved to LA in October and on the 23rd of April it makes six months and oh my gosh I can't believe it you guys like it's seriously unbelievable my journey has just been like so amazing so fast like I have done so much I feel like I've done things that it takes people years to do in LA like I have seen I, I just don't even know what to say you guys like if you follow me on Instagram then you clearly see like everything that I do in LA everything that I've been a part of and I'm just so happy and so blessed like it's just the beginning you know like so much has already happened in six months and I'm just excited for what the rest of my journey here in California has to offer. Someone is calling me private. Who is this? Hello? Hey, girl. So that was my friend. My friend. All right, so that kind of threw me off a little. <laughs> So I've been getting a lot of compliments here lately, like on my wigs. I do make my own wigs, as you can see. This is one of my wigs that I made. It was actually, I don't know if I wore this wig in one of my videos. It was a red wig, but um, yeah, so I've been getting a lot of compliments on my wigs here lately, and I actually have two wig orders, so that's pretty cool. I don't really like, um, no, I don't really do hair. I don't really like doing hair. I know how to, but I don't like to. So, I just do that for like, you know, close friends and stuff like that who really need their hair done. I'm <laughs> going to a party tonight, so I have to do my makeup. I was going to do some a 420 like makeup tutorial, but I don't have the green eyeshadow like I want. I want like that, you know, like this color green. I want that color eyeshadow and I don't have it. And all of my other green eyeshadows are not like a true green. They're like teal green or like off green. So today I'm just gonna do what I've been wanting to do for a while. 
So ever since I started using my Morphe Hey Girl Hey palette, I so forgot that it had another great palette. It's the Anastasia Beverly Hills Artist Palette. I'm gonna go with my transition color in Dusty Rose using my Morphe B81 blending brush. You guys, this was my first like name brand palette and I feel so bad for neglecting it, but hey, at least I didn't throw it away, you know? When I got this palette, I was like, oh snap, they're not gonna be able to tell me nothing. <laughs> But honestly, at the time when I got this palette, it was for Christmas, and I did not know how to properly do my eyeshadow, and I've learned so much since then. So, I'm glad that I finally picked it back up. All right, now I'm going in with the color Blue Velvet in my palette, and I'm going to apply this right in my crease. I'm just taking my MAC 275 brush and I'm really blending that eyeshadow out so that it won't look so harsh. And I'm just blowing out that color so it can be like a perfect smoke. Okay, now it's time to create that cut crease. You guys, ever, ever since I learned how to do cut creases, I'm like so addicted to just creating different looks now. If you don't know how to do a cut crease, my latest video will help you create a cut crease, you guys. Alright, for my lid shade, I'm going in with my Golden Glory Eyeshadow by Morphe. This eyeshadow is perfect, you guys. I love it so much. This eyeshadow reminds me of like the perfect penny. You know how you get those new pennies and they're like perfect, shiny? And now time for my favorite part, the blue liner. Oh my gosh, I love this blue liner. It's by Prismatic and it's a color liner and it is everything you guys. I got so much good feedback about this eyeliner on Instagram. And it's like electric blue, it's just, ooh. Okay, I'm not gonna talk right now because I have to concentrate on getting this perfect line. The only thing I don't like about this liner is this tip, like the felt tip. It's really hard to blend and apply the liner, but it just takes a little longer than expected to really just fill in all of the space. A good thing is this liner dries really fast fast so you don't have to worry about it like transferring or bleeding it dries like really fast now that the hard part is over with I'm just in love with this blue liner y'all like when I'm done with this whole face like it just really brings that liner together let's go ahead and pop on some falsies I'm going to pop on my Lena lashes, you guys. Mm -hmm. These are my favorite lashes. But y'all, these eyelashes are so like everything. You ever just be doing your makeup and you just want to try something different? <laughs> you so sick of doing the same thing over and over and over again. Well, that's how I'm feeling right now. I'm going to highlight and conceal before foundation. Well guys, let's see how it goes.
blending in my foundation first because I'm afraid that <laughs> if I go on my concealer first, it's not going to come out that good. China Technique actually wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad at all. I'm so used to doing my makeup, like, <laughs> not talking. I have nothing to talk about. <laughs> Nobody wants to hear a bunch of talking anyway. I just love contouring my face, like. It's my favorite part, like, oh, Love it. That double chin is gone, honey. Gone. So I'm almost done. I went ahead and finished most of... I went ahead and finished the rest of my makeup off camera. And I'm just going to do my lips now. I'm using my House of Duché lipstick in the color Sunburst. And my Kylie lipstick in the color King K. Honestly, don't know how this is going to turn out, but we're going to we're going to see. All right, you guys. This is the finished look. Yes, another look smashed on the charts, you guys. I am in love with this look. This lipstick though is like everything. It's like everything, y'all. Because I'm so extra, I just added some dots at the very center, at the top, and I added some glitter. Added some glitter on my tail. I'm just being so extra today. But I really do love the look. It's really pretty. This look was really focused on the eyeshadow and the eyeliner. But do you like? Do you like? I have four more days left of this challenge where I'll be uploading four more videos. You guys, this is a lot of work. Just recording and doing the makeup and then editing and uploading and descriptions and all of that stuff, y'all. It is a lot of work and I do appreciate you guys actually staying tuned in what I've been doing and um, just being with me throughout this challenge. I do appreciate it. Um, that is all I have. I've done enough talking for today. I'm about to get dressed. Make sure y'all check out my Instagram. Thanks for watching. Peace.